What is up you guys, Dan Isaac 2006 here in this new-ish setup. That's literally just my fucking dresser. Uh, today we will be reviewing the Transformers Kingdom Voyager Class Optimus Primal. Taking a look at the box, because this is new and interesting for once. My first Kingdom figure, yes. Uh, gorilla mode right there. Primal mode right there. I love this artwork. This is my favorite artwork in the entire... In Siege's entirety. Uh, uh, yeah, you know what I mean. And on the back here, we got some product shots. We got Optimus Primal right there. And we got his monkey mode. And that's not not much more to it. They stopped using the... Uh, plastic ball uh the plastic uh trays so that's interesting also i don't know where i put the card but uh i i i have the sticker you see it's the sticker guys look it's the stick but yeah all you really need to know about the cards is that they're very nice high quality cards getting down into this monkey's accessories comes with these two very beautiful cyber blades that he used in the Beast Wars show. And these are very nice. A lot of very nice molded detail. I wish we... I wish the blue was a little bit more vibrant, but it's whatever, I guess. But, yeah, I these are, these are really nice. And it can hold them as well. So, yeah. Yay. And he can look absolutely badass while doing so. This figure does have storage for these swords. They can just peg into this hole right here. These tabs you can peg on either side. And that looks nice in my opinion. And yeah. Again, that looks nice. This figure has a few tricks up his sleeve. <laughs> and fucking hell, he looks awesome. Few more weapons, deployment, gimmicks, whatever the fuck you want to call them. Uh, things he does, he has his shoulder cannons. If you just untab this, I, I find it easy by just twisting the heads around and just finagling them out in a feasible way. And then popping all that back in. And that looks awesome. And I'm pretty sure these are compatible with blast effects. Same with these. And here we have Primal all weaponed up. And I love this look. I really do. But I don't display him like this on the shelf at all. I just keep all this stuff in. And I have him with his blades. But actually going into this figure's detail. Oh my god. I love this head sculpt. That's so Optimus Primal. It's almost like it's the completely... It's almost like it's the fucking character or something. But yes, th this head sculpt is absolutely amazing. I love that they went with the realistic gorilla instead of the uh, the more Beast Wars accurate gorilla. Uh, yeah. Also, I do know the the name of the gorilla he transforms into. It's a silverback. So I'm not a fucking I'm, I'm not a fucking idiot. Uh, okay, yes I am, but not not in this case. But going down his legs, these uh, a lot more nice molded in detail. It's very very nice. I love this figure. He handles a backpack pretty well. The kibble management, the the, 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 the the kibble management on this figure is very well as well. Uh, very well as well. He does it. He, he pulls it off. I don't really have much to compare him to since I don't have any other Beast Wars figures or Kingdom figures. So yeah. But here he is with Earthrise Optimus Prime, and these two look amazing together. And here this is, this kind of comparison is as well, because I love this. Sorry if I seem really weird in this video, I'm trying to, I'm, I'm just, I, I haven't filmed in a little bit, because the last review that went up, the Soundwave review, I filmed like, oh, a, a week before it released, so... Yeah, I just I'm not really able to emote my words or convey what I what I want to say in a in a good manner right now. I'm just kind of I'm droopy right now. But nevertheless, we're gonna get through this. We're gonna get through this review. We're gonna it's gonna be okay. So going into this figure's articulation, he does I think have a ball joint at the head. Can look up that far down? Not at all. 
very tight on the swivel. Shoulders can do a full 360, move out that far, in that far, bicep swivel, very nice, over 90 degree elbow bend, that looks very nice again, once again. Wrist swivel, that's really tight on mine, fingers can move as well, god fucking damn it, again, I'm just droopy. All right, but yeah, the, the fingers are on a hinge as well, and that looks nice. Waist a swivel, can move this monkey all around. Spread that far. Legs can kick forward that far, backwards that far. That's very nice. Upper thigh swivel, which is really tight and limited. Double jointed knee, it's also really tight and ankle pivot and the ankles are on a piston or really just the just the robot mode toe but yeah that snaps into place very well uh, also now all we got to do is maximize this malicious ape uh, i'm just kidding optimus primal is awesome okay what i first like to do is i just close the shoulder pads untab this rotate the chest rotate the gorilla head bring this back push that back in snap that back in and we're already almost done bring this down rotate the waist actually before you do that and now he's in king kong mode he looks weird as fuck and now i believe what the what the instructions want you to do is just <sighs> really fucking fucking tight on mine but I think they just want you to push in the legs, just bend them backwards, and that looks interesting. Oh, oh yeah, and bring these feet up as well. And that looks really fucking weird. Now, to get him not standing anymore, to get him in a fucking... Oh, fucking Christ, I can't do it in this video. Watch that nerd Isaac. Watch that nerd Isaac have a fucking mental breakdown while reviewing a gorilla. But to get him on all fours, you just want to bring these legs back up like that and make sure this tab, let me focus in, this tab right here pegs in there. And that should be that. Just second first, same on the first. Same, same as the first. God, I fucked it up. And, yeah, just get him less in a less awkward pose, and you should be good. And realize your camera is out of focus. Bring the head up. There he is in monkey mode. And I like this mode quite a bit. He can beat on his chest, which I absolutely appreciate. And, yeah, this is just... This is an interesting mode. In terms of articulation, the arms are the same. Head can move up all the way down. Not very far, it can swivel. Not the best, but if you look it up all the way, it can swivel pretty well. Waist, swivel, very tight, unless you lift up the skirts. And then you're good. Speaking of which, the skirts are on hinges. Legs can move out that far. Still, the uh, fucking thigh swivel. Knees are all over the place, and yeah. Very interesting. <laughs> I really, 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 really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please be sure to comment, like, and subscribe. Check out my Instagrams in the description below. Do all that stuff, all that important YouTube stuff. I hope you guys enjoy this video. I hope you guys got a laugh out of it. I hope you guys enjoy the new setup. Thank you guys so much for watching. Peace. Goodbye.